Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. This video is going to be about a little viewing window for change in size. So this square I have is five by five. And if I have a bunch of them, and I'm changing a bunch of them, so let's just make a couple. When I change, let's make this one smaller and make this one smaller still. So when I'm changing that size, I have to look up here to see what size it is. Well, if you will go to Tools, Options, Customization. Okay, there it is. Commands. And then type right here, Size. Now, there are two of them. This one, so you need to be off the shortcut. You need to be on the general. This one is Crop Size. This is the one you need right here that says, Object size, set the width and the height of an object. Okay. We're going to make a hotkey for that. I've already made one, but let's just delete that so I can show you how to do it. Right here, just type in and everything's taken on, at least on my keyboard. But if you make it like, uh, you know, you can't make it alternate S. Uh, I'm just going to make it alternate M and assign it and then say OK. Now, I click on my circle and hit Alter and hit M, and I get a little box right there, and I can change the dimension to 3.5 uh, 3.5 by 2.5. I don't have to look up over here. If I wanted, you know, if I had a lot of these to do and I want different sizes, so Alter and hit M, and I'm going to make this one four by four. Alternate M. It brings up the little window. I don't know that it'll, you know, it won't make both of them the same. Oh, it does. So it's just like up here if you have your ratio lock. Let's just test that again. Let's unlock our ratio. Alternate M. And let's make one of these three. So if your ratio up here is locked, and you go alternate M, all you have to do is change one dimension. And let's make this 3.75. And it made it both 3.75. Pretty cool little hotkey, basically. Anyway, I hope that helps somebody, and thank you for watching.